Look at this. I've had these yellow neocaridinas now, September, October, eight, ten, ten weeks, I, I guess. And, and there's a buried female. That's doing, that's just great. So they're happy in here. There were, God, I can't remember, I think about 22 of them. I'd have to go back and watch one of the old videos. And if you're interested in the unboxing I did of these, you could go back and watch the old video. Maybe let me know. But they look good. It's just a tank full of uh, these yellow golden back, Neo Caradina. And there were some red ones in here that I think I just pulled the last one out. And now there's also a, yeah, that shit ton of bladder snails in this tank. And hornwort. And I'd love to have snail-free hornwort. But I've got to find something to uh, get rid of that. Get rid of the snails. You know, and I keep hearing, well, you overfeed the tank. And no, I don't, because I really don't feed this tank. Because it's just the, just the shrimp they're picking off the bioslime off that big chunk of Mopani wood. And this the bioslime that grows in the hornwort. As well as, once in a while, I will drop just a little bit of... Uh, uh, frozen brine shrimp in here and from a, a cube and I'll hold on to it and just rub a little bit into the water and that's it not the whole cube and I'll also drop uh, an algae wafer in here once in a while and that's about all I do for these keeps it simple and that's enough they seem to be happy and that female is going to drop that's her on top there she's going to drop god soon I'm guessing so that's going to be a load and then maybe I can start thinking about spreading these out. Anyway, there you are. And like I always say, I appreciate you. And thanks for looking.